Today, I'll be showing you how to teach the bow naturally and with a rope. There are multiple different ways to teach this. You don't have to use any of the ways I taught for know how to use it. But you can use these as ideas to help make your own method, which is what I did for her lay down. Now, first off, you're going to your horse. I'll start out with teaching it with a rope. You want your horse, a rope, and another rope, okay? Because you're probably going to be back here, and your hand isn't going to reach up to their halter to pull them back. For this, you're going to take the rope of your run the leg. You're going to pick it up, hold it up, grab the other lead rope, and pull it back. Pull the leg and the head back so that you're down. They're down, stop, they're done. Now pet them and praise them. That was a really fast bow. When I taught her to bow, first off, I did not use a rope to start. I used treats and it took me a month and a half to teach it. Once I started using the ropes to teach her other side, it went a couple of days. So it just depends on how soon you want it and what you're going for. With this, you need to watch them As you pick up the leg, you pull the leg back, and you pull them back, and they bow. That's what you'd like. That's with a rope. Now let, let me show you how I taught it when I was first starting. Tornado and I started out teaching the bow as our very first trip. You and your horse. Horse, rope. This time, just have a lead rope on your horse's halter, okay? Have your horse. I used the lead rope to keep her there, and I'd take a treat out and put it through her leg and offer it till she bring her head back and down to grab the treat. That's how I started. Once we got a hang of that, I picked up her foot and she'd bring her head back, kind of like that, and then I'd let her go. And you just did that over and over and over. Then I would pick up her leg and pull her leg back and offer it. And the moment she moves her leg backwards, I'm gonna let go. Because she's learning it. She's learning what I'm asking and what I want. And the release is her reward. You also wanna make sure that you have enough room to do this. So you're gonna pick up the leg offer out a tree or whatever. You can also just grab the rope and pull her back until they go down and let go. Great way to teach it. That way took me a month and a half to teach her, but it was also our very first trip. Some horses might catch on super fast and you can do it that way in a couple of days or a couple of weeks. I found that she learns it quicker if I have a rope and a whip to help teach the cues and the commands to what I want. So it's all up to the person who's training their horse because they will know the horse best. Personally, I would rather teach the bow with the rope because it got me the result quicker. However, teaching it without the rope is also a really good thing to do. It just, it helps bond with your horse and it's great connection time. If you would like other things such as riding dares or how to videos, please comment down below with your thoughts and concerns and things like that. I'll be happy to answer all of your questions along with doing any how to videos you guys might like to see. Thank you. Have a nice day.